Hey everybody, welcome to TXGameHunters.com. The purpose of today's video is to show you how the One Shot Zero feature works on the ATN Excite 2. I have the 5x20 model here right now. I uh, just shot two rounds down range. I don't know if you, I'll zoom in here, but uh, I think you guys should be able to see I'm just slightly high, uh, about an inch and a half, two inches high which really isn't bad for a hunter because then at 200 you're going to be dead on and at 50 you should be uh, should be pretty close uh, but we're gonna change that here to, for you guys to see let me zoom in so I can show you where my shots are and I do not have the Butler Creek modification on here right now uh, so it's a little bit grainy when you zoom in mess with the focus just a little bit for you and as you can see as you can see here Here's the bullseye. My two shots are just a little bit high. Both dead on each other, so good grouping. Uh, zoom back out to base magnification, and we'll do a minor adjustment and do another shot. All right, so back at base magnification here. Uh, to adjust the one shot zero, hit enter. Go left to the settings, which is the little wrench. And if you guys have not watched our other video, which goes through all the features of the X-Site, please do, because it will help you follow along if you don't know where what each setting does. Uh, I'm going to go over to Profile Zero, go down to Current, because that's the one I'm on, and, and Zero Reticle. Alright, so now we're in here. At the top of the screen, you can see where it shows. Actually, you can't. There we go. Hold on, let me move my camera. All right, now at the top of the screen, <laughs> you can see where it shows the uh, X, Y coordinates um, and everything here for you. Let me zoom out just a little bit, actually. I might be zoomed in a little bit too much. Let's... There we go. All right, so you can see everything here. Uh, you can see your elevation, your horizontal, make sure everything's right, right where it needs to be. Uh, and now we're in here. Now to change the settings, you still, when you move with your arrow key here, when you start to move, you see the green dot here moves around and the white uh, crosshair stays where your other target was. So the goal is to put the, keep the white target, the white reticle, on the target where you were shooting, so on the bullseye, and your green reticle to go where your shot actually hit. So I think that's pretty close, maybe down just a hair. And this is base magnification. All right, so once you hit enter, it brings you into a new feature, which is you can select zoom, save and exit, discard changes, or go back. We're gonna hit zoom uh, because then that allow actually I'm going to hit save and exit right now uh, just to make sure it's saved and if you notice the X and Y coordinates is now a little slightly different now I'm going to hit enter again like we did before but I'm going to hit zoom so now this allows you to actually zoom in and make changes uh, if you hit enter again it brings you back to being able to make changes Hit enter one more time and it brings you back to this screen. So I'm going to hit zoom and we're going to do one more shot here. Safety off. Everybody clear. All right, safety back on. And it looks like, see, it did come down. We're going to zoom in. Looks like I'm just at the top of the bullseye. just at the top of the bullseye so now we're actually going to do a minor adjustment at full zoom just to show you so I'm happy with that adjustment now I hit OK I can change it if I want so let's say I was just a hair too high now I could but I'm gonna leave it like that it is now and hit zoom and I can zoom in, which I could have before, but I wanted to show you guys how to get back here. So now let's take one more shot at full zoom. Safety off.
pretty good on. I'm going to take one more. Dead on. Actually, that's a hair low. I'm going to come up just a little bit. Safety on. Hit enter so I can make changes. And I'm going to come down just a hair. And let's take one more shot. Let's do one more shot at this target. I pulled that one. I, I pulled that one again, but it's right on center where I want to be. And I'm out of ammo, so I need to reload. All right, so I'm pretty happy where that is overall. Uh, I pulled those two, but as you can see here, we're, we're right where we need to be. Hit enter to get back to where we need to be. Save and exit, and we're done. So that is the overall function of the one-shot zero feature of your Excite 2.